the thumbnails that YouTube picks. Like, I mean, I'm the one who picked it. I'm the one who did it, but still, I don't know. And then I realized like my kitchen looks like a dark hole. It's white light, so I don't know what's better. Dark hole or white light when I'm clearly basked in like a very nice daytime type glow. Um, I would prefer the camera all the way over here, but whatever, we're just gonna live with it and I'm moving in. Jenny! Hey! Hey everyone, I'm gonna try to come around what up jennifer josh welcome candid welcome evil doctor mainstream welcome Woo! So we're gonna be doing a legal California weed haul. That is what is up this evening. Did you have a good workout? I did have a very good workout, felt great. So this is from a company called MJ Delivery. There is a code, maybe I'll remember to put it in my box. I don't know how many people are gonna watch this from LA. I don't wanna list all my dab options, so pick one through seven. Four. No, three. Louie, what up? Todd, hi. Or is this what you're talking about? Cheers. Mm-hmm. Weed delivery is a big thing here in LA. That was not something that was possible in Washington State, so I never really experienced that until I moved here. But it is very cool. <gasps> Strawberry cough, hell yeah, I love that. Okay, let, uh, let us, lettuce, smoke a bowl. Um, I know it's really nice when you've been drinking or just like it's later, you don't want to go to the store. I'll do a little OOTD. These jeans are not as high waisted. Usually if I'm wearing a crop top this high, I like something even more high waisted. It's a nice Levi's. These are actually a size too big, but they still look like crop tops from Zara. Who cares? <laughs> Nobody, I can tell you that. But, excuse me, bless me. I look really good, thank you. Cheers. Gosh, thank you. Old school, thank you. Thanks, guys. Is JJ live? I feel like every time I go live, he is also live. No, I do not do that intentionally. Um, I'm going to pull up MJ right now, and so we can see if these products are still currently available, how much the prices are. Sometimes they do, like, discounts. I know some of the eighths, eighths I got for, like, 35 which is pretty good. Oh, my God. He is live right now. God damn it. I need to grind up some more. So, let us, I will show you five of the products are all from the same company because they were doing a discount on that company's products. So I'm gonna show you, he was talking about my home. Oh. So I'm gonna show you the things that I bought first. I got this Pure Beauty because it very much reminded me of the Skims, Kim Kardashian type shit. It's tradition, y'all have to stream at the same time. God damn it. Well, you guys, go subscribe to Uptown Grow Lab. So this Pure Beauty, I believe this was on sale. It was ice cream cake for an eighth. And it is $35 for an eighth, which really is not that bad. Let's take a look at the packaging. 
flippy around. I wish this was not so unstable and I wish that my light was not exactly right there. I would move you guys, but then I'm moving where I'm set up as well. So let me just move the light this way. Maybe that will be better. Oh, my ankle, that did not feel good. Yeah, that is great. We'll see how it is for when I flip it around though. All right, Jenny, go say hi to JJ. My nails are a mess, so please do excuse that. So like I said, it's very much kind of the Kim K look of like the simple shit. Um, here is all the percentages. Ice cream cake is an indica dominant strain. I can attest to that. 22.37 total cannabinoids. 18.55% um, THC, 0.78% total terpenes, and you can see the little terpene breakdown right there. Let's look at the actual jar. I love this. It's like a smiley face. How cute is that? And here is the rest of the jar. Like I said, I just like the simplicity of it. And again, excuse the disgusting nails. And here is the actual bud, which is very, very beautiful. Oh my God, yeah, now you see the nails up close. That's horrible. I'm just gonna leave it like that. You're just seeing it like this. Listen, if you want me to get new nails, subscribe to my OnlyFans, onlyfans.com slash positive smash 420. I will be doing a 20% discount for a week, so that's fun. I'm posting some really fire content, if I do say so myself. And I do. I was just gonna wear leggings, and I should've, because you can't even see my mother effing pants. So you know what? I'll be right back. I'm gonna go put on my sweatpants. Ooh, that I was wearing with these yesterday, this shirt. Uh. This is my homage to the classic monochromatic look. I'm just a big beige bo booty. <laughs> Don't mind me. Cheers. What am I drinking? It is Jägermeister Spice. YouTube makes me want to commit demonetization. I can't watch this on my phone, but can't watch. Uh, because you're sad. Well, that's weird because I know I put it probably 18 plus. So that's probably why there's like only so many people in here because it is 18 plus. Cheers, guys. Okay, so I believe what I'm smoking was this pure beauty. Right? Right. Thursday weed haul day, thank God. Nice. Oh my God, do you see how much this moves around? It's the thing that connects to my tripod. It's not the tripod itself. It's really killing me. So that, like I said, was $35 through MJ. And then the next one is from this company called Wonder Brett, Louisiana, nice. I know I haven't been live for a minute, but 
Either I'll come back live again on Sunday morning, and if I don't, I will be back live again next Friday night. I should be. At least let's do that for the next little bit until... Until I see how my life goes moving forward. I might have to get a real job. I need some lip gloss. I feel like my lips were looking a little crusty dusty. All right, like I said, the next strain is from a company called Wonder Barrette. Very, very high end. This is Pink Picasso. Um, this stuff is not cheap. It is not available. <laughs> Sold out. Fuck. I know that this was not cheap. Let's look at other Wonder Brett strains. Like 50 for a gram. Oh, that must be. That must be something else. Jeez Louise. Um, let's look at, they, got, they have nothing on here right now. So I can't really give you a comparison. Oh, an eighth is 53, there we go. Thank you. All right, let's flip it around and give it a go. <laughs> oh, you're you're still zoomed in. Um, this is the packaging, nice and pink. So all their packaging is different depending on their strain. So that is very fun. You could get the rainbow of colors. Very simplistic, like apple packaging. Pink Picasso coming in at THC. Total 21.92 CBD or I guess not total, uh, THC 21.92, CBD 0 0.06, total cannabinoids 25.75. And it's just, it's just nice, nice fucking packaging. Flavors on flavors on flavors. The inside of it is a nice, simple black jar. How pretty is that? And then inside is some dankity dank flour, which I have smoked a good hefty, oop, just dropped that. I've smoked almost all of this, so we've got one nug to look at. But very nice. If I was doing this like real style YouTube video, this flour would be looking fucking fire, let me tell you. It really would. Oh, it smells, it smells so fucking good. It's unbelievable. It really, truly is. Really, truly, deeply. Um, maybe I'll have the next stream be not 20, 19 and over, 18 and over. Such dark colors on the bud. Are you enjoying the California? I am, Carla, thank you. Or maybe we should flip over to the other channel and do a little, like half an hour here, half an hour there. I don't know. I know I'm gonna get hungry soon and I, Sam was gonna cook. We'll see what time he ends up eating. Cheers. And cheers. Ah! Woo! I'm glad I was able to catch the stream recently. I've been at work still when you're live. I know, Jenny, I haven't seen you in forever. 
long, long time no see. I feel like. Okay, so the next couple of things are all from one company. This company called Leum, I believe it is. Oh, you can't really see. thumbnail. I know, stupid jobs and responsibilities. Um, that's awesome that you have a job. Congratulations on that and fucking finishing school. Are you done done with school now? There's something weird about these though, which I'll explain in just a second. Oh, thank God you're done with school. Jesus. The other, the other bad habit of mine. Where are ye, Sir Vapalot? Sorry, my cat was just being cute as fuck. I cannot resist a cute cat on a bed. Oh my God. I cannot resist giving a kitty a pet. Carla, welcome. I thought you were here. Not welcome. I'm back. I just had to go get my vape. And then I pet Reggie. Was I gone for like 10 minutes? No. I was gone for just a minute. Just a moment, corporate accounting, Nina speaking. Just a moment. Do you guys remember when like vape tricks were a huge thing? It is a two bedroom. Cloud Wars, oh my God. I mean, that actually was pretty dang. <laughs> I think it helps that I'm at such a low nicotine that like you can go to town. I wonder if Foodie Booty does her live streams at 18 and over. Should I do a live reaction to Foodie, Foodie Booty on my Bots and Smash channel? I feel like I have no place doing a Foodie Booty reaction, but at the same time, I've been watching her since literally BB days. And the thing is, I've never actually watched her videos. I always watch other people reacting to her videos. So I wouldn't even like, I would just have my own commentary on other people's commentary.
nobody knows who Foodie Beauty is that I'm watching. Good to see your smile. Thank you. Who I'm watching, who's watching me. Okay, back to the haul. I have two strains that are supposedly the same and one strain that is totally different. Now, here is my weird dilemma. They trip, they, why is that so hard for me to say? Vape Trick Olympics. Wow. That like almost made me have a stroke. Vape Trick Olympics. Jeez Louise. Okay, this is again another, these are all Leon products, all in one vaporizer. This is 250 milligrams. I mean, this is like nothing. I can vape one of these quickly. Don't look at the fucking nails, okay? <laughs> three, three to one THC to CBD. Uh, Pina Dream. It has a Best Buy date. That's interesting. THC, 62.68% or 156 milligrams. CBD, 20.67%, 56 point. Six milligrams. Now the packaging is kind of tricky to open. You got to squeeze and like, meh, meh. Okay, I got to do it off camera because it's hard to do. <laughs> I mean, it's just, you squeeze there. See, it's just, this angle is hard to do. The inside is very pretty, okay? Unlike my fingernails. Somebody's phone was ringing, that's weird. Losing my mind. Uh, it's just a cute little vape pen. I think... It's very nice. It's very satisfying. It's a nice THC to CBD ratio. Stone yellow. Welcome, sir. Did you get a notification? Let's see how notifications worked with the 18 and over designation that I chose. Finley, welcome girl, how you doing? Okay, this is what's weird. You got notified, good, okay. So these are all from Leon. These, as you can see, are the same color. And on the website, they say that it was the same strain, Cloudberry. But on the jar, this says Gmo. You did get notified, okay, cool. Perfecto. Let's look at it up close and personal. Juneshine, Gmo. June shine, or June shine, <laughs> June, Gmo, and this one is Cloudberry. Indica Leaning Hybrid Dream. I feel like on Indica Leaning Hybrid. So I don't know if this is the same strain or not. And then I think on the bottom it says Cloudberry, like this. So I don't know why this says Cloudberry, this says Cloudberry, but the top and the front say Gmo. I don't understand that. And this, just like the other vaporizer, very pretty, very nice packaging. Dream into Kalina Hybrid, 90.54%. Oh, it's from Desert Hot Springs, okay. Um, you squeeze and you slide. This one's very pretty. I have not tried this one yet. And then let's take a peek at the flower. just weird. The other one is the same exact way. I think that hybrids are just hybrids and, you know. Ooh. Mm. 
It's not the most pungent, delicious smelling weed I've ever smelled. This was, I think, also $35 for an eighth, which is like kind of honestly low end prices. Uh, L-E, U-N-E, oops, nope. Um, then let's go to this search bar. The disposable vape pens are, I think it was just 20? No, this is something else. Why are you doing this to me? It keeps popping up something different. Let's go to flower. This is not the most, like, best website, clearly. This was working fine, and now I'm, I guess I just became stupid. I guess so. I just got high. Okay. The flower, like I said, I believe $35 a piece. And now let's go look at the concentrate. It's going to be under vapes, and then there's a little thing with the little three things. <laughs> Liu, and we're going to choose the company. These were $30 a piece for the vapes. Now, the reason why I got these, honestly, uh, is that a big stem sticking out? It probably was. Been over a week. My tolerance was way down. Nice. Okay. The reason I got these is because they're super fun for photos. Because you can get matching lingerie. <laughs> and get super fun pictures with the vape from this. Fuck, it's so tasty. It's so, so good. These vape pens are awesome. That's the only reason why I've spent so much money on them. Um, and that's probably what the majority of my purchase was honestly was these papers it's so good though god damn okay so the last strain that i got was desert gold now the same thing for the other product that it says that like on the website it said that it was cloudberry the flower and the vape this it said that this was desert gold and this was desert gold but then when I got this, it says mimosa, desert gold mimosa. What is that? Sativa leaning hybrid. And then on the bottom, desert gold. Mimosa. This is desert gold. Create sativa leaning hybrid. 81.6%. 0.2% CBD. <laughs> Sound like an, a television announcer. You press it and you slide it. There we go. I'm getting better at doing it on screen. Once again, really, really fun to take pictures with these sort of things because they really do pop. Um, mixed light flower. I don't understand what that means, but okay. So I guess maybe there's a mix of mimosa and uh, desert gold in here. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. But it do be looking pretty fine. It do be looking pretty fine. Look at that. Nice. 
I wish the light were shining on it from this way. Sorry if I keep banging you guys. <laughs> I think the first one I ever had from them was the Soulberry. They also have one that's naked, naked disposable 81% THC and it has a one star review. So that's not great. That is not great. Now the smell of this one, it smells kind of, I mean, calling it desert gold is good. There's that, I know that smell. It's kind of like, I don't mean this in a negative way, but like dry grass. <laughs> like dry, not grass grass, but like meadow grass that is like wet. I don't know, ew, that sounds like really bad. That does not sound like a desirable thing to smell. I'm looking for my eye drops because as a stoner who wears contacts, that's probably the number one problem. Oh, hallelujah. Praise God. Thank God for whoever the person who created contact lenses was. Like, you're a fucking genius. Let's give this one a little poof. I have not since I got it. These, this is my first time opening this. I did open the flower and smell them, but I did not open these. Not like hay. Candid. I haven't been doing a lot of live streams, honestly. Mm. Or just that you've like missed them in general. Ooh. That's very nice. I would say it does taste More like mimosa than, I don't know what desert gold is. These are things that in my actual old weed reviews we would have gotten into. Yes, yes. Um. It just has the pre-rolls. I wanna look by strains. Strains. Desert Star, Desert Sorbet. Himalayan gold, like, so I don't know what this truly is, you know? We Let's go to the Leon website. Let's do some deep dive real quick on this. See, like, this fucking matches my outfit. So how sick would it be to do some cute pictures smoking With this, it makes it so much more fun because I love being matchy-matchy. Uh, it tastes really good. I will say that. I love vapes too. They're very... Uh, easy to use. So they do, Leon does have desert gold flower by itself and then they have the mixed light. I got the mixed light, I do believe. By combining natural sunlight and supplemental eco-friendly lighting, 
Leon mixed light flour brings the benefits of both, both cultivation techniques together into one ready to grind package. Desert gold is your on the go secret weapon. Great for going out, getting stuff done and finishing your next masterpiece. The vibe is uplifting, creative and inspiring. Okay. And it does say on here, create. You ever share transfers? What? Are you done? What is this? I think this, I might have pressed too hard. No, it's close now. Nope. Um, Juanita chips? No, I think there are going to be no more Juanitas. So it's just a different grow method. I guess so. Ever watch transformations? What's that? God, my contacts are so dry this evening. Ooh. Mm-hmm. Oh, Juanitas, thank you for reminding me. <laughs> Juanitas, it be so so bad. Tacos Juanitas, Juanitas restaurant, I don't think it's the same. Ah, Juanitas food, okay, this is it. Uh, let's see. It doesn't say where I can get it. It doesn't say where it's available. What? This is Vaughn's. What? No. Where? Bitch, where? Okay, I can just order it online. Does it is it gonna ship to me? I am shocked. I am shooketh. I had not even thought about the Juanitas for a minute because I was just like, no, I need to like sign in to add. Sign in to what? I don't have a fucking Vons account. Oh, it doesn't say, it says in store, in store where? Instacart, Target, Target? Where? I am like, hold on. I, it says it's $2.29 for a 15 ounce bag. Where? Why is it not letting me see where it's available? It just says Target. You, now you've got a stoner thinking about her fucking Juanita's chips, which I know are not available here. But it's telling me they're available. So, pick it up. Pick it up where? Oh, in Seattle, because this is still on my Seattle thing. <laughs> Google, I thought I told you to change my address. Oh, we're hitting... Don't even start with Jenny, with me, Jenny. I know Juanitas are amazing. No, it's not available around here at all. At all. 
Vaughn's supposedly. I am gonna have to fucking go to this Vons and see if there there are Juanitas there. Listen, follow me on Snapchat Positively Smash or Instagram Positive Smash to find out the saga of the Juanitas chips if I did in fact find them. Let's see where this Vons is. I know where that street is, but it's like a, no, no, okay. No freaking way. I guess I never go down that way. This sh kind of shows how, like, I just stay in my little hood. <laughs> my little neighborhood so much. Cause it's like, it's, I don't know. Mike W, welcome. Love the bong cabinet, thank you. <laughs> you ship some to me. They must be some damn good chips. I wanna try them now, love me some tortillas. They are the fucking crispiest, oiliest, saltiest tortilla chips. So just like, some Juanitas with a piece of cheddar is everything to me. And I've been kind of wanting to make a chilaquilas, but like a white girl way. So <laughs> a really good tortilla chip is needed. Oh, tortilla chips with queso, girl. Don't even get me started. I'm definitely not going to this Vons tonight. So come back next week and find out the saga of whether or not I found my Juanita's chips. Okay, so I have smoked some of the, I believe it was the Pure Beauty ice cream cake. It is very good. It is indica leaning very strong or it's just an indica straight up because shit knocks me out every single time. Now this Wonder Brett, I believe that pink Picasso is a sativa leaning hybrid. We will look in just a moment. I am shocked that this remote works from over here. It's very nice. Uh, pink. Pink. I was trying to see if it was going to autofill, but it didn't. <laughs> Until I got to the PIC part. All right, pink Picasso is a hybrid weed strain made by Crossing Candyland with OZKX. Pink Picasso produces euphoric effects that leave you feeling blissful and uplifted. Consumers who have smoked this strain say it is relaxing, but will not leave you locked in the sofa. In fact, some consumers report this strain pairs well with exercise like yoga or Pilates. Pink Picasso features a smooth citrus flavor profile with undertones of earthy pine. Pink Picasso is believed to be 22% THC, making it an ideal strain choice for experienced cannabis consumers, such as myself. According to weed growers, the original breeder of Pink Picasso is Wonder Brett. Shocking, amazing, fantastic. It says myrcene, which I don't know, earthy 
that's a dominant terpene, myrcene. Earthy, peppery aromas with flavors. The most common terpene ranges from a little bit chill to sedative chill, also found in thyme and lemongrass. It also has a limonene, citrus, and caryophyllene, which is pepper. And I think Candyland is a sativa strain. And OZK is... It doesn't really have like a, if it's indica or sativa. So pick a number one through seven. Let's do this time six. Ain't marketing wonderful. Ooh, guacamole, yummy. All right, so we're gonna grind up some of this pink gas. So I definitely have smoked it and I definitely think that it is Pretty damn fucking good. Like Wonder Brett strains are just in general very good, very delicious. It smells very unctuous and earthy. Flavor and aroma pungent. I would pungent, unctuous, same fucking thing. Top effect, focused. Okay. Lemon meringue. No go for lemon meringue. Lemon meringue. I, I said six. Cheers. There's a bit of a down stem or a down stem, a stem or something stuck in this little, little piece. We're good. Oh, Candid's at seven. Sorry. I still go with the... You know me, girl. I'm all about the fucking citrus strains. You can take a girl out of the California desert, but you can't take the citrus out of the California girl. I've always been obsessed. Oh, Candid, I'm so sorry, girl. You'll just cut the difference and do two. What is number two? What is it? All right, so this is the Wonder Brett Pink Picasso. Cheers. Oh, as in you'll do both? Nice. No, <laughs> most definitely not. I have two friends that have, well, one that has smoked marijuana, the other that has not. I don't think the one that's not, whatever. I don't know, maybe. That is a fucking damn good weed for me, y'all. Like, I, this Wonder Brett, their strains are fire. I would love, so there's like weed delivery services. If we can get the subscribership up, please, if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Thank you so much. That felt good. Felt nice. Uh, we are almost up to 2,000 subscribers. I can't believe it. So we're definitely going to do something special for 2,000. I don't know what, but I definitely feel like we should celebrate all of the milestones. Maybe we'll give away one of the pieces in this case. Who knows? <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Thank you. So I'm pretty happy with my purchase. It was not the cheapest. Oh, Jenny, I should have just given you a bunch of stuff before I left as well, girl. This 
is my favorite girlfriend time hanging out with you guys. Oh, I'm so glad we can be there. Be here, be there, or be square for you. Um, uh -huh. Doing good, Donna K. How are you, girl? So there are Nug Club, Lucky Box Club, Mary Jane. No, I guess this is also Nug Club. Nice that high couple did that. Did the subscription box. So. Sway. I was just like into reading what I was looking at. It's hard for me to read. Oh. I would love to get LASIK. I'm just such a baby. I don't want laser near my eye. And you can't rub your eyes. Like, no. Immediate recovery generally lasts six to 12 hours. Most patients see clearly within 24 hours of surgery, but others take two to five days to recover. 5,000 per eye? Holy Christ. I am five foot five. Very normal, basic biotype. Eh. You should do it, Candid, if you haven't already. That's sick. I didn't know that it was so quick. It can take about two to three months before your vision fully stabilizes and your eyes heal. Listen, what I worry about is washing my face and rubbing my eye and like destroying my eyeball. Oh my God. I would be the type of person that I would have to wear like the thing over my eye for like weeks just to be sure. No, that scares me. My love, come to me, my love. Oh my God, you're so fat. Oh, look at you. You're so cute. I love you so much. A <laughs> cone like a dog. How would I wash my face? I don't want to break out. Look at his arm. Reggie, I love you. He is so dangerous. He fucking tried to jump on the ca in the case today because the glass is glass. He has jumped in there before when I've had it open, but not any bongs in it, luckily. So it wasn't a big deal. Reginald. Oh, I love Smidge. Love Smidge. 
I don't love all your hair, though. I don't love all the hairs, though. And she's a bear town. Then I would get worried about getting water into my eyeball. I was, I'm just, I have a fear of the LASIK. Reginald. You have bad allergies and rub your eyes. Uh, see? E. E. Ah! Oh my gosh, it's 9 p.m. I feel like such an old person. I'm actually tired right now. And it's the night is young. I was literally talking to my best friend Lefan last night about how as you get older, like when you start your night, like you can't start your night at like eleven PM or midnight like you used to when you were younger. Like, oh my gosh. Even New Year's Eve for me, though, when I was younger, sometimes was, like, not doable. Arnie. Oh, That was sweet of JJ. Well, das Vidania. Cheers. We're about to go. But... I got some good little products. I'm pretty happy. I'm happy with this haul. Sadly, the flower, especially like the high end, the pure beauty and the wonder Brett will not last me long. Like these, I will smoke very quickly. The Leon will last me a little bit longer. Did you get any dabs? I did not, sadly. I'm not a huge, huge dabber. So now that I showed these, I guess I can put them away for once. They've just been sitting in this bag. And let's smoke the last little bit of this bowl. Thank you guys so much for watching. As I've said, you can follow my link tree. I believe it's just Positive Smash. You can follow my OnlyFans, OnlyFans.com slash Positive Smash 420. I'm doing a little discount right now. Sorry to mention that all the time. You can follow me on Twitter, Positive Smash. Instagram, Positive Smash. Snapchat, Positively Smash. And Reddit, Positive Smash, where you can get a sneak peek at what I what I got going on. Thank you guys so much for being here. Cheers. Don't forget to smash that thumbs up button, like and subscribe. <coughs> Ooh. It is delicious, but Girl, she is strong. Jenny, thank you so much for being here. Candid girl, love you. Thank you for being here. Donna K, thank you for being here. Robin Riddle, thanks for being here. Arnie S, thanks for joining here at the very end. Sorry that we're getting out of here. Um, If I didn't say your name, I'm sorry. Josh, thank you for being here. Mike. All of you guys, I think I've scrolled as scrolled can do. Enjoy the rest of your night. Happy Friday. Be safe.
consume responsibly. I will see you guys hopefully next week for another Friday Night Live. Love you guys. Bye. And Patreon. Patreon.com slash positive smash. <laughs> Bye.